right, for a long time I was using the fracture modifier version of Blender to do fracture animations in Blender. And it worked, it still works good, but it has not been updated from the old 2.79 and earlier UI or GUI, graphical user interface. And it's still the old version. Even though they, they say that they plan on making an updated version, it has, in three years or so, it has not come to pass. So I'm guessing they're not going to. I hope they do, but I'm guessing they're not going to. And if you don't know what the fracture modifier version is capable of, here's an example that I did a while back and basically this video is showing what the fracture modifier does basically it allows you to demolish stuff like this all right now a while back these people approached me and they sent me an email and they wanted to know if I wanted to uh, do a review of their add-on which is basically very similar to the fracture modifier version of blender except it's an add-on that goes into the uh, new versions of blender and this was a couple months ago I meant I've been trying hard to try to find the time to actually learn this add-on so that I can make a review video of it and I've actually tell you the truth I've been feeling kind of bad because they give they gave me the add-on free of charge and I've had very little time to even try it out but let me first say this add-on is available on Gumroad and Blender Market I will put the link to both of these in the description of this video now I do not have any examples where I've done stuff with it. quite frankly I just have not had the time to learn how to use it yet but they have a channel called RBD Lab and I'm going to show you some examples that they've made using their add-on and to tell you the truth I love this add-on I just wish I had the time to actually learn how to use it this is very very similar to the fracture modifier version of Blender even the layout of the program itself is similar, although quite a bit different in the way it works. But it still works good. But I'm just showing you some, some examples that they have on their YouTube channel. And I'm encouraging you to go check it out. Go check out their channel and check out their add-on if it's something that you'd be interested in uh, using. In my opinion, the stuff that they've done looks good. And the add-on is, from what I can tell, it's constantly under development. And they're adding new features all the time. Eventually, I will have the time to um, do a proper review of this add-on and show you some, some examples of stuff that I've made using the add-on. But like I said, I just hadn't had time to learn it yet. But I felt kind of bad because they get they gave me the add-on about two months ago, and I just haven't done anything with it yet. But either way, check out their YouTube channel. I'm going to put a link to their YouTube channel in the description of this video, along with a link to their Gumroad and Blender Market uh, pages. That way you can check out this add-on. And their um, web, their YouTube channel. Check out their web, their channel. They have some tutorials on there, and uh, many examples of what can be done with this add-on. From what I can tell, this is a really nice add-on, and I can't wait to actually find the time to learn the add-on. But anyway, check them out. Give them a subscribe and, hey, check it out. That's all I can say. Later, people.